Hello and welcome to this Pundit PI8000 tutorial. Impact Echo, Grid Mode, Review. On completion of this tutorial, you'll be able to play with results for concrete thickness and defect detection in grid mode. Once you have completed the grid measurement, you can start revising the data to detect the thickness or any kind of defect. In the main view, you can see the heat map and the frequency domain graph. Step 1. Select the spot you want to check clicking in one of the boxes of the grid. Step 2. Then, using two fingers, swipe up to change from the heat map view to the graph view. You can see both the time domain and frequency domain graphics. Step 3. You can navigate from one impact to another by pressing the impact button. The waveform highlighted in orange is the most accurate one of the whole series of impacts. Step 4. If the value received is smaller than the average thickness of the element, it is very possible that there is a defect or an embedded object. You can always delete any individual impact by pressing the number of the impact. This is very useful if you want to eliminate abnormal results. Step 5. You can mitigate the signal noise using the high and low pass filters. Step 6. You can also automatically identify the FFT peak selecting the auto detection button. And you can always go back to the main page swiping two fingers up. Step 7. More information about the defined spots can be included selecting the information button. The name of the spot can be changed. Also, you can upload a photo from the library or create your own one. Creating a voice note or written comments is possible as well. Step 8. There is a logbook that keep a track of all the activity.